The new Hines County interim sheriff, Marshan Chrysler, began work today replacing the late sheriff, Lee Vance. 12 News' Gary Burton Jr. sat down with Sheriff Chrysler about his plans for Hines County. Gary, what'd you find out? Interim Sheriff Marshan Chrysler says his number one priority is the detention center and crime coming at a close second. And with the November 2nd special election coming up for the position, he wants the people to know that he's qualified for the job. Just days after former Hines County Sheriff Lee Vance was laid to rest, the Board of Supervisors decided that former Ward 6 Councilman Marshawn Chrysler will become interim sheriff. People know me in my capacity as a city councilman, uh, and I understand that. But well before I became a city councilman, I spent 20 some years uh, putting my life on the line protecting the good citizens of Jackson and Hines County. Before serving eight years as councilman, Chrysler was police chief for the Utica PD. He is also a retired major in the U.S. Marine Corps and was a narcotics investigator for 17 years for the Hines County Sheriff's Office from 1992 to 2009. I think I'm eminently qualified uh, to be sitting in this chair. And as long as the citizens of Jackson allow me to sit here, I'm going to break my back to try to make sure I keep them safe. Chrysler also was the public safety commissioner for the city of Jackson while Sheriff Vance was the JPD chief before becoming sheriff in 2019. I would not even begin to tell you that I, I'm attempting to fill those shoes because that would take another lifetime to do. But what I do say is, is that he set the tone and he set the example uh, that I intend to follow. And his way of doing this is by focusing on the detention center and creating more space for criminals and starting a rehabilitation system. We are focusing on getting criminals a skill set while they are incarcerated. So when they return to society, after they pay their debt, then they will be prepared to make a living wage. And to get the crime numbers going in the right direction, the agenda is to work with the local police departments to create a crime suppression plan. And the special election for the Hines County Sheriff's position will be on November 2nd. And today, Hines County Constable Leon Seals was the first to qualify to run for the position. For 12 News, I'm Gary Byrne, Jr. Back to you.